Hi. My name is Anina and I'm the CEO of 360 Fashion Network. I'm here today to bring you the latest fashion tech news that you need to know. Before we start, if you want to receive this news roundup regularly, then hit that like button and smash that follow as we will be bringing you this new every week to keep you in the know of the top stories we think are important. Alright, first up, a major upgrade to Bitcoin is happening soon, Taproot, a highly anticipated upgrade to Bitcoin, is expected to go into effect in the coming days at block 709,632, some sources say it'll go live as soon as Saturday. Taproot will introduce what's called Schnorr signatures, which will help Bitcoin transactions become more private, efficient and less expensive. Most importantly, the upgrade will better enable Bitcoin to execute smart contracts on the blockchain. News source, CNBC, Amazon adds to its Rivian stake, nestled in Rivian's S1 IPO filings was a note that the AIR company's cornerstone investors had indicated an interest in buying up to $5 million worth of its stock at its IPO price. One of those parties was Amazon, and the American e-commerce giant appears to have pulled the trigger Friday afternoon on its buy. News source, TechCrunch, now it is possible to produce photoreal 3D digital humans on demand with programmatic control of facial appearance, body type, clothing, pose, and actions at an unprecedented scale. This functionality unlocks the ability to build new models for smartphone, teleconferencing, and automobile customers. The company's synthetic data capabilities enabling the programmatic generation of millions of unique, high-quality 3D digital humans. Your job as an actor is in trouble. News source, Cision PR Newswire, Unity, $49.85 million market cap, acquires Weta Digital, the film production and 3D effects firm co-founded by filmmaker Peter Jackson, for $1.625 million Weta's portfolio includes Avatar and Lord of the Rings, Unity primarily targets Weta's tools and engineering team, and the firm's visual art team will spin off. News source, TechCrunch, dating will always be in style and a time when fashion plays a major role when going out on a date. So it comes as no surprise that Match Group, the parent company of Tinder, Match, and Hinge, has announced plans for a dating metaverse. The company made the announcement during its Q3 earnings call. The company is planning to launch avatar-based virtual experiences that will incorporate its Tinder coins. The company is currently testing its virtual economy in a few markets in Europe. It plans to roll out the coins to all its users to be able to make in-app purchases like Superlike and Boost. News source, TechCrunch, and that's it for today. If you want to get the full top 10 fashion tech news items of the week, check out our new podcast 360 Fashion. Go to 360fashion.net podcast or search for it on your favorite podcast platform. Don't forget to subscribe so that you won't miss our latest episode.